Uh, it's Belman. I don't know how to say it. Belmain. I bought it on net porte On where? Uh, net porte okay. It showed up. It was too big. Um, there's an amazing tailor called Aureli, who <laughs> my stylist Misha knows, and she went Boop, and got it like to the right size okay, perfect. in one day. Perfect. Yeah, I'm, I do everything last minute. Okay. Um, what is it like working with all of these great dynamic women? It's amazing. It's like, it's a really a dream come true, honestly. Yeah. And seeing everybody tonight, I know you had to junk it, but just getting everybody together, are you guys going to go go big tonight after this? We, Elijah was trying to have a dinner, like, while the screening is happening, because we've all seen it, but there's not really time for that. So I don't know, maybe the after party. I have my child by myself right now. She has a babysitter tonight, but I'm, I'm the one who's getting up at 6.30 in the morning, so I'm a bit like, I don't know if I want to go out. Okay. Yeah. Well, and hopefully she has Meowie. She has Meowie. I love that you know the name. That's so sweet. She has Meowie, thank God. Yes. Yeah. Um, and I bought a backup Meowie. Oh, you did? Because I know Meowie was left home. Yeah, Meowie was left at home. It was a big disaster. But now there's like a backup Meowie, just in case. Now, is she... Now, I heard that she is, or didn't hear, but she's most likely walking in your footsteps and your husband's as far as being an actor. How do you feel about that? Listen, my husband is third generation acting uh, dynasty. I, I think it's just in her genes. Like... She, she looks in the mirror, the other day she was sad about something, she was crying, and she stopped crying, we gave her cuddles, and then she said, I'm just going to see if I can cry a bit more, just out of curiosity, you know, she's like, loves being on a stage, she loves performing, it, it just, I think it just is what it is at this point, we have to let her be happy. Yeah. I just want to throw back quickly to Heavenly Creatures, in this photo here. If you can kind of tell me what was it like back then, that was, you were 15, yeah. uh, working with, with Kate. I was so overwhelmed by her. She was so fancy and professional and I was just trying to learn as much as I could. I really loved her, yeah. And, and finally, I know that you mentioned Fatima. Yes. Uh, uh, Fatima, you're, you're psychic. Uh, I, it's true though that yeah. she, she predicted this success. She did at a very strange time in the middle of the pandemic when I had done the pilot and I had not heard a word about it. So, it, I mean, she's right. She's always right. Has she been right about anything else? She's been right about a lot of stuff, but I don't know if I can say, if I can say any of it. I'm trying to think. She's been right about a lot of stuff. Okay. And, yeah. and finally, uh, season two, what can we expect? It's crazy. I, I, it gets a lot deeper into the lives of all the characters and you meet new people like Elijah, this wonderful human being. Um, Simone Kessel is new to the cast, Lauren Ambrose. It's an exciting season. Like it, it gets bigger, but it doesn't get unwieldy.